Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to transform your plain um, leather wallet or perhaps um, you know any of the leather accessories that you have with the beautiful wolf um, artwork. So um, at the beginning I usually start with a sketch. Um, I never use any templates, uh, I never copy um, you know an artwork from someone else um, I do all my projects um, by hand so um, they're all freehand and um, obviously I get some inspiration from the from the photo from the pictures but um, the whole process the whole drawing pretty much the sketch of the project I do uh, with my own hands I do um, a really simple outline, um, obviously some shading to create, to create some sort of um, three-dimensional feel. Um, but then obviously it takes about 10-15 minutes to make a quick sketch like this one. And then I know approximately how am I going to place my artwork on the wallet. So um, as you can see I taped up um, the side, the edges of my uh, wallet previously. And I'm starting with making a um, white kind of abstract, um, you know, splashes of paint. All my artworks are um, created, you know, very naturally, um, you know, in a more of an abstract way. Um, you know, I do like to present my art um, in a little bit of a unusual unreal way obviously all the paintings that i um that i do the artworks they usually represent um you know realistic uh, scenarios or realistic creatures um like this one for example but uh i was never aiming to you know to make my artworks in a really really you know realistic way to make it look you know almost like a photo because i simply don't think this is the purpose of an art in my opinion you know the purpose of of an artwork is pretty much to you know just to express yourself um, obviously you need to learn some basics like the shading like how to you know how to paint and how to draw in a way um, you know your drawing is perceived as a three-dimensional object or as a three-dimensional scenario which you're trying to represent uh, you know that's obviously this is something that you can do you know using uh, lighter or darker colors or perhaps using um, you know more dense lines or more kind of uh, freehand um, you know freehand lines but um, yeah I really encourage you to create your own you know um, bespoke projects because you know it's not only something that only you wear out of you know out of all people all around the world but um, also the entire process as you can see I mean it's really um, it's really calming it's really relaxing most of the time obviously unless you're trying to do something to deadline like I actually sometimes need to to get orders for customers and stuff like that but um, you know if you if you want to do something for yourself even one or two products bespoke products it's you know it's a really really good way to go um, I mean if not you can always ask me to um, help you in any projects but um, you know obviously with my professional background um, I do uh, I make custom orders already but if not try to do perhaps the same artwork yourself um and uh, you know and let me know how we how it came out so i hope you enjoyed the video and if you have any questions comment below